Well, hello. You're here to show you the the JC Dugard and your name puzzle, your coloring right here. As you have it to where the star is talking about the story about JC Dugard, and then along with the bookmark right here, and along with the the reading glasses, and uh, so far as the the different sections of uh, you got that you know the, with the book, and then so far as talking about the the first time, and along with the secret backyard, and then along with the others like you know discovery, uh, reunion and stuff. You got the you know, the different sections of, of the book right there, and then you got of course you know the the moon right here, but the, of course it's like if what I went ahead and and did right here was to come up with the you know the, an activity so far as is a name puzzle so far as a it's like a, a you know different the puzzles that you can think about uh, that you can maybe come up with so far as you get the you know the, the word search right here, you got the the word search and then uh, along right here. As you have the crossword, and along with the lost found, along with you've got the plant earth right there, and then along with the you know the other things that, that to discover. But uh, but basically, if we remember whenever we were in school, that, that we, uh, which I remember doing a lot of crossword puzzles, that uh, it seems like that the, there in the book that they're talking about you know whenever she was uh, taken, and then uh, along with the, you know her her childhood life, and then along with the so far as being found, but. Um, I guess you could say it's kind of like you know lost and found, and uh, of course it's like with the with the puzzles that uh, you can kind of describe it as uh, is that uh, that you know a word that you can be looking for that could be in the puzzle such as the crossword such you know as year or it could be a holiday such as a birthday or as like reunion or you know anniversary or something, and then uh, you get that the 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 say the word search right here, but basically. You have with the word search that uh, I remember I had complications with them a couple of times. You get you know, so far as JC the guard, and you know, or it could be inside the puzzle. You can maybe write that, yeah. That uh, you know, it's like so far as the word search could also be you know maybe lake or you know pond or you know maybe you know that you know the 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 greatest beach you know in the world or something like that. You know the Batoma Baton Beach or something like that, but. But basically, is it talk about you know the name puzzle? Is if you could think about is that uh, if you can maybe memorize you know all the names of the different rivers and the different lakes or maybe the different cities, you know different parts of the of the world, such as you know in, in a certain country, or it could be you know the continent or whatever, you know Australia, Europe or whatever. But uh, basically, he's talking about you know with the different colors right here, and uh, basically is that talking here we got the, the rain right here. But uh, if we could maybe say a, a word, such as is that if we were to you know, maybe pronounce a word, go ahead and maybe add a little bit of detail. So far as around, uh, say for get the, you know, the plant Earth right here, and to say that, that if you can maybe draw a map, you know, somewhere, you come up with the, with the idea of a puzzle, is that you come up with the idea of a map, and uh, of course it's like a, so far as it's a lake, you know, of a, of a lake that you been to or maybe your favorite your, your favorite event would maybe be fishing and uh, of course is that uh, I could not even say more likely maybe the Lake of the Ozarks will be a, a place for that was a uh, one of the times I went fishing I, I went fishing you know about you know ten years ago but uh, of course you know fishing and uh, so far as that uh, is other cities and and states that uh, you know that uh, of course, you know maybe maybe Utah or whatever, but uh, but different things that you can maybe think about. Which I remember this word right here, you know Mississippi, M I S S I, S S I, and P P I. For whatever reason, whenever I was in the third or fourth grade, I think it was the fourth grade that um, I memorized this. You know, I memorized this. It was like a game, a game, you know. Uh, activity that the, the teachers and I we were doing that uh, that for whatever reason that that um, that word right there I would probably say if I were to do a spelling test so far as a crossword or spelling test more likely I would probably say that uh, if anything there would be a very, very little possibility that I would get it wrong because more likely that you know, it's like that that was that right there was like memorized like a birthday to me it's like the way the way they taught you in school how to say you know Mississippi or you know how to say you know, maybe Kansas State that if you could say you know maybe Kansas um, you know Kansas uh, 
state, you know, memorize you know, maybe your home state or whatever, your hometown or whatever, that a lot of times that that, that, that was like like a birthday, you know, name, so far as, as the name puzzle, that that was like a birthday. And um, what I mean by birthday is something that, you know, it was hardly ever common, you know, for you to spell it wrong, for you to make a mistake on it or whatever. But um, so far as the book right here is you got the, you know, the pine cone charm. But, uh, of course, is that uh, you get the, the pine cone right here along with the moon. You can maybe think about that, that, you know, that there's uh, different names, you say, so far as the surfaces of the moon and along with the surfaces of the pine cone. You have right there, you got the, the pine cone right there. Of course, just, you know, you put a shade, you know, shade a little bit of green around there, just like, like a leaf. But um, I'm sure that we know is that uh, so far with the leaf, a leaf can maybe have different names. You can maybe make a puzzle uh, that is it uh, so far as is the different names you can make it into uh, like a crossword. So just one part of a leaf could be you know the, the stemo or something like that, or it could be you know the outer layer. So far as the, the sunflower, you can maybe think about the, is that the, if you make a puzzle uh, that it's like you got the, the leaf right there, and then along with the, the sunlight, which of course I'll go ahead and put a little bit of a of sunlight detail right here and of course with the rain which most of us would probably say that uh, I know where rain comes from it comes from the sky but uh, <laughs> more than just the sky I guess you could say it comes from say uh, around the world it could have been you know hurricane uh, you know, it could have been a hurricane, you know, uh, Aluma or something like that. You know, it could have come come from the southeast or whatever you call it. But the, of course, you had the different directions right here. So you had the different directions. It's like uh, you had north, uh, north, south, east, and west, and whatever the direction that the the wind is blowing. But basically, it's talking about the, the fact about that whenever you do a, a crossword or a word search. Is basically is talking about you know if you were to is connecting that to different words and so far as the calendar. Whenever I was, uh, I would probably say whenever I was in the in the the third or fourth grade, I think it was the third grade that I uh, memorized you know the of course the you know the year, you know the year, the month, and then that long the the yard and along the day and then the time. It's like I pretty much learned I do a, quite a bit of that whenever I was in school and so far as a as a you say is that if you could uh, you know maybe you know, write it down it's like so far with it about you know how many of how many inches is equal to uh, maybe maybe two inches it's like you know, I guess it's like a mathematical type of problem to where it's like a one and a one and a half you know inch and a half or inch and, and three-fourths something like that it's like a it's like kind of like a fraction problem right there but so far as it's uh, you know it's like you always say it's the holiday. If you can maybe memorize uh, every holiday, let's just say if you can memorize every holiday, maybe that the the world celebrates. So far, you know, that includes like Chinese New Year, or it could have been uh, you know Mother's Day. So far as Mother's Day, along with that, you know the parenting you know, day, or you know any other type of holiday, that more likely that uh, I'm sure that you know if we can make a like a crossword or a word search type puzzle, then uh, more likely you know that could be that could be done, and you know the, you know be able to memorize it, and uh, along with the you know HTTP, which don't even know, I guess that means hyper hyper tech, you know tech, uh, you know page or whatever you call it, uh, and then www for World Wide Web, you know dot com, and uh, more likely that you say this is that you know we pretty much would need to go to school. You know, for maybe you know five more years just to learn the basics about you know about about technology, about computers. But uh, but basically, so far as is the name puzzle, you can look at it as so far as is to say you know the word computer. And uh, of course, um, computer. And uh, I'll go ahead and zoom in right here. But uh, let's just say if uh, uh, you know come up come up. So you're compatible, and so you come, so you don't have a whole lot of room, but uh, say so compatible, uh, you know, open, uh, you know, open monitor, I guess whatever you want to call it, um, compatible monitor, 